We're here at the Des Moines Bucks Arena getting ready for our game. We're going to go talk to the VP of Sales and Communications, Scott Montesano. Well, the Des Moines Buccaneers are a minor league hockey team based here in central Iowa. The Buccaneers have been around for 30 seasons, actually 32 now as we're in the 2011-2012 season. And what we are is we're about fun for the family. That's really what we are. There's two different sides of the organization. There's the organization, the coaches' side of it, that is trying to move the players on to the National Hockey League. Our side of it from a business standpoint is to get butts in the seats and <laughs> show people a good time here. And how many players do you have right now? We've got 23 players from all over the country. What we are is Junior A hockey. Our players are not paid. They're actually 18, 19, 20 years of age. And hockey works different than basketball and football where you go to high school than the colleges. It's a lot different in, in hockey because there's so few college hockey programs out there. Think about it. There's over 300 Division I men's basketball teams, all right? Mm -hmm. If you can make a three-pointer, you can play Division I men's basketball. There's, there's, there's a lot of chances. Yeah. College hockey, there's only about 30 programs out there that offer scholarships. So our players come here. These are the ones who go get those college scholarships. And then off the roster, two or three of the guys will make it to the National Hockey League. So this is the next logical step for them. This is the place that people yep. want to be to get to that, yep. that spot. Okay. So um, how many people do you generally see out at games? Well, this building seats 3,400 people. The building was built in either 59, 60, or 61. And depending <laughs> on who you talk to, yeah. you'll get three different answers. But the building seats 3,400 fans. We get in here 3,000 plus a game. The building uh, squeezes them in, that's for sure. We squeeze them in here. People have a great time. It's a throwback to the way arenas used to be. Even when we have a smaller crowd, like 24 or 2,500, the place is jumping, the place is rocking. A lot of free parking around here. People have a good time when they come out to a game. Yeah, and you've got games Friday night, Saturday nights. What else? Mostly Friday and Saturdays. There'll be the occasional midweek game that comes in, but mostly Friday and Saturday night games. 7 o'clock, you'll get out of here at 9.15, 9.20, so it's a quick time as well. Mm -hmm. It's it's a high adrenaline rush for two hours. And it's a really fun place to come with your family, as you said. Um, if people wanted to get tickets, how can they do that? Very easy. Just go on the website, which is buckshockey.com. We can do it on the internet. Or you can stop by the box office as well. We're here Monday through Friday. And again, great place for the families to come out. We see a lot of families out at games. It's a great place for... Uh, obviously guys to come bring their dates to. Yeah. It's a great place for husbands to hang out with their wives. It's a great place for the wives to hang out with other wives. It could be a will. girls night. <laughs> uh, it's just a fantastic time here. One thing a lot of people don't recognize is that 52% of our fan base is female. Mm -hmm. A lot of people think of hockey as just being a male dominated sport. Yeah. It's not true. 52% of the women, 52% of the fans are women. A lot of the women like the looks of our players. Hockey guys, <laughs> I've been told, uh, are quite attractive, so that doesn't hurt our uh, appeal either, yeah. I guess. everybody to leave here, win or lose, with a smile. Now the smiles are always a lot bigger after we win, Yeah. but regardless of whether we win or lose, we want people leaving here with a smile. Yeah, you want to give everyone a good experience. Yeah, we want people to show up and have a good time and give them that extra bang for their buck. So every ticket averages about $15 here. They cost a little more to sit down close to the ice, a little less to sit behind the goal, but mm -hmm. about $15 uh, for a ticket to come in here and then very cheap concessions as, as well. There's a lot of ways for people to get tickets. Uh, the easiest way is to go on the internet. You can go to buckshockey.com, get tickets. All the tickets that we sell at the box office are available on the internet. But of course, you can also stop by the box office, which is right here at the arena, Monday through Friday, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. We'll be more than happy to show you the best spots to sit, uh, the place to avoid, the place that you really want. And we'd be more than happy to give people a tour of the facility as well. If they haven't been out here at all or haven't been out here in a number of years, we'll be more than happy to allow them to come out here, 
sample some seats, if you will, before they purchase their seat. Well, Scott, thank you so much for talking to us today, and make sure to come out and see the bus.